Yeah, this is the noia. Guess what? Think of this, you little slaphead twat. Um, apparently, <laughs> that's so in his arse, that's so in his arse. Right, apparently, women can get bald treatment on the National Health Service, but men can't. What do you think of that? Do you think that's fair? Is that a fact? It's a fact. We what? should point out that Carl is, uh, would you say balding? Yeah. Would that be fair? Well, either that or a wide parting. <laughs> 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 yeah. look, he looks like Charlie Brown. He's got the same sort of hair arrangement as Charlie Brown. Yeah, he's, he's I like don't think it. Charlie was, was balding though, was he? He was only about ten. Well, no, but he just had, like, a couple of yeah. things on top and he's, and he's, his hairdo, Carl's had a hairdo that keeps it's it- It's not a hairdo. <laughs> No. What is it then? What is it? It's- it just happened, I've told you. <laughs> no, no, uh, hey, don't. Noel was in, right, once. Noel who? Uh, Gallagher. Oh yeah. Right. Oh right, your first name terms. Right. Yeah. And uh- From the hood, isn't he? And- and whoever was doing the interview said, uh, oh, you know, what- will- will Liam be able to keep up that sort of hard attitude, right? Uh, say when he gets older and he goes bald. And, uh, you know, could he- could he still carry off the- the sort of attitude that he's got? And he was like, no, no, he'd, he'd never have that style. He couldn't- he couldn't have that style that lad's got in there and pointed at me. Yeah. I said, it's not a style. <laughs> I said, I didn't go to the barbers and say, can you just, like, shave the top bit, leave the sides? <laughs> yeah. Can you move a little fly attack? It's the way it is. <laughs> yeah. Right, and you were just saying to me, what would you do if you- if you went back in time, I'd probably use a better shampoo. <laughs> 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 I, do, I wish we could tape the conversations we have off air. Yeah. Because, I mean, they are ridiculous. <laughs> what would you do if you go back in time? And the other sh stuff we were just talking about is obviously can't talk about. Can I just ask though? Sorry, wh when did you when did you start to notice it was disappearing? I mean, at what age did it kick in? Uh. Uh, I worked a lot. You see, you, you'll- you'll be safe, do you know what I mean? Your hair will stay there, but it's when I used to do a lot of hours. Sure. A lot of hours working <laughs> and that. Yeah, you were stressed and things. Yeah. Stressed yeah. out. Yeah. And it just went- Well, I'm beginning to understand that. what stress is like, you know, cause I'm not getting messages and stuff like that, but yeah. 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 But, uh, yeah. probably about, I don't know, twenty- twenty-four? That's uh, unlucky, isn't it? Something like that. And did you- did you panic or did you- were you just not quite sore? Not bothered. Not bothered. <laughs> He's not bothered, he wouldn't be bothered. I'm not bothered. <laughs> but I don't think- for someone who doesn't care about going bald, or war, or SARS, or anything. You don't have to get stressed on a Saturday between one and three. <laughs> to be fair, you are worse <laughs> than all those things. <laughs> <laughs> SARS has got nothing on you when you're in the right mood. <laughs> but why, why is it alright for women then to, you know, have a wig? But I couldn't have one if I wanted one. Well, it's not a wig, they get bald treatment. They actually can get- they can get their hair replaced on the National Health, which might be anything, I suppose. Which might be wigs, which might be transplants. I mean, the only- the only cure for baldness is a transplant, which they literally take, um, follicles. They can get down to individual follicles now, from the back of your neck, and, you know, it takes a long time. And, you know, but, um... Well, people will know anyway, won't they? I don't know when it starts, though. I don't know when it starts. Like, now, if you started wearing a wig, people go, we were wearing a wig because you were bald yesterday. Yeah. You can't- you can't start thinking, right, I'm gonna go bald in a year, I'll start wearing a wig now. That's the thing to do, isn't it? It is really, if you're that bothered, but I wasn't- I, I just thought, right, it's losing it a bit, shaved a lot off. But did you know you had that round head underneath it? Did you know it was gonna be that funny, though? You would've- well, you presumably worn a wig, wouldn't you, if you'd've known? Cos I've never seen a head that round. I think the barber, when they did it, right, the woman said, you can pull that off, you've got a good shaped head for, uh, for uh, having it shaved. She, she meant- a good head. Yeah, she looks like a tennis ball. You look like a tennis ball when you haven't shaved. She said if you can pull it off, she said that's- that's like a good thing to see if someone's good looking. If you- if they can have a bald head, it's like Sinead O'Connor. Yeah. Right? She can pull it off. There's- there's those sort of things. Do you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, of Alice. No, but that's like one of the things. If- if you look good with a bald head, mm -hmm. that means you're pretty good looking. Yeah, yeah. And if you can wear a, a bicycle helmet and look good. That's another thing that, like, <laughs> you must be pretty good looking yeah. to pull yeah. that off. But who, who, who have you seen <laughs> in the bicycle helmet that you think- that you think's good- who have you seen in the bicycle helmet and thought, oh god, they must be good looking, they're good in the bicycle helmet? Well, everyone that's what I'm saying the No one looks good, do they, really? It's so, so what, what do, do, would you say Brad Pitt would look good in the bicycle helmet? Well, I don't know, I'd have to see. But I'm just saying that's- that's like one of the two things, really, that's- And what- what blokes do you think look good, bald? Who do you think would look good, bald? Uh, don't know, give me some names and I'll tell you whether they'd be alright if they're bald. George Clooney? Uh, I don't- I, no, I don't think he does. I don't think he would do. 
Uh, who else? Well, this uh, could run and run. Um, Al Pacino. Uh, yeah, you could probably pull it off. He'd probably look all right. Do you think he looks all right with hair then? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, well done, Rick. <laughs> Sony award-winning stuff. <laughs> Play a record. 